Yep, you saw that correctly. I'm a tightrope walker. Yep, I'm one move away from injuring myself pretty badly, so I'm not gonna move at all. Oh, look, a penny down there. <laughs> uh, terrible intro. <laughs> Hello guys, welcome back to channel. Uh, so today's episode, we're gonna return to the Milk Carn Alley build stuff. I wanted to take a mini break from this. This was never meant to be a project. Let's let's be real here. I only meant this place for my milk carton, but it became more than just the milk carton. It became a whole little mini project, I guess, which is nice. I haven't done a project in a little while. And today's episode, we shall be working on one of these apartment buildings, finally. I think apartment building? I guess we can call it an apartment. Decorate it for Christmas as well, you know? I want to I want to make it all festive so that's what we're gonna do now the thing is I don't know which one to decorate so you're gonna watch me choose which one in the video <laughs> I kind of want to do the one across the street this one looks pretty cool and I made a little yard for this person whoever lives here they have their own yard so yeah we're gonna decorate this okay by the way it's just a rectangle there's a, like a little bit of a diagonal right here but um, yeah I think can manage to build this it's gonna be pretty similar to my actual milk carton house I think but I'm gonna try to do like a different layout obviously I'm gonna try a special layout Ooh, it's not that big of a house either okay actually wait hold on i'm gonna do color code all right so color code of the day okay we're gonna do this one from it's sanchez sanchez medic hi pete of the millionaire also color code please do and thank you they really want me to make a house out of dressers wardrobes and closets i don't know that seems we'll see one day one day but i'll use your color code so let's let's do that their color code is one one two 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 three three that's an interesting oh it's a that's a nice interesting blue color I like blue, kind of blue in a long, long time, so that'll be fun. Let's go and get this started. I might actually move the front door a little bit closer there. We're gonna use one of these fence gates instead of just two. One, one, one. There we go. Aluminum slat gate. Can I like... Okay, let's just... So this is their yard. All right, so it's more than just the house. We're gonna make a little yard for them too. Um, whoever lives here, I don't know. I guess I'll spend the night here sometime. Let's go ahead and make a layout because we already we have pretty much a shape started for us already. I mean, <laughs> not started, but done. I kind of want to extend this a little bit. Just add a little thing over here. It's kind of like it really is going to be like my house because it's rectangular, but that random piece. Oh, this one got a diagonal though. It's special. It's got a diagonal. And I think I'm going to do a slanted roof over here. Maybe this could be like a shed or something actually. <gasps> Ooh, <laughs> what kind of shed? You never know. Sheds can be different shapes. Actually, though, that's kind of... That might be interesting. That might be interesting just to have that. I just realized there's no actual roof on it. I was just trying to toggle the roof back on, but yeah, there's no roof on this. Okay, problems with is making a roof for a modern building. You would think it's simple. I'm pretty sure it is. We'll see. Maybe just flat, right? Just a flat roof. Add like a little bit of a... I'll just do that. It's going to be a flat roof. Would you call this an apartment? I'm going to make... I'll call it a studio. A studio apartment. Okay, studio apartment vibes. Okay. Oh, <gasps> yeah, that's the title of this video. I just found out the name of the title. Building a Bloxburg studio apartment. You already know what's going to happen. I'm already like going to guess like there's going to be like a kitchen over here. Maybe some staircase leading up to the next floor. Living room here. Yeah, I think that's I think that's the only layout, right? Unless I make the kitchen like right here and then do the complete opposite. Like kitchen maybe here. Living room over here underneath the bedroom. I could do that. Right now, mine is just the kitchen underneath the bed space. Like the second floor. Actually, no, the living room's like underneath. Oh, hmm. okay. Let's just figure out where the stairs are going to go. I'm thinking way too much. Sometimes it's okay to think, but don't take too long because you're going to waste a lot of time. <laughs> I, I do that a lot. We're going to waste some time today. I might go with... Oh, wait, modern spiral stairs. Spiral stairs are pretty like studio apartment like, right? And it will save us some space too, actually. Okay, hold on. Let me just undo all that and then grab this. Or should I use the modern one? Because it's a modern building. I might as well. Okay, I think we're gonna put the stairs here. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, living room, kitchen. I'm gonna do a kitchen here. If it fails, if I don't like it, I'm gonna swap it back to kitchen over here, living room here, but... Yeah, let's do that. Walk right into the kitchen, your living room to your left. There's gonna be a bathroom right here, I think. Should definitely make this the bathroom. Okay, got my plans, got my plans. And I'm gonna try and just use the modern, pretty much like as much modern furniture as possible, because it seems like a modern building. Okay, I don't wanna spend too much time thinking about stuff. Oh, hey, and that's that's that. Unless I want to close it off. It's going to be open. Like, this this build is small. All right. Let's go and do the second floor now. Oh, this is going to be weird. It's going to be weird. I should look at some studio lofts and just kind of see. 
if you look at these studio lofts, like, yeah, they they look pretty minimalistic. Look at that. It's so simple. Like, imagine this in Block Break. You would be like, wow, there's not much in this house. But in real life, it just looks better, doesn't it? Here's this one, a little bit more decorated. You got a lot of plants. Look at that. Oh, they got a bike up there, too. <gasps> I don't know if I'm doing minimalist. Let's be real here. Do I ever do minimalist? So yeah, this is pretty much the second floor. It's another loft, studio loft apartment. Sleek glass ceiling so you don't fall. Of course, some more railings there. Okay. Oh, that's a that's a that's a concussion. If I ever saw one, actually, would that be a concussion? I gotta test this out. That's not a concussion, right? Oh, it isn't. Wait, that's pretty nice. Okay. Wow. Look, see, we already got a glimpse of this house. Empty. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Nice. We pretty much have our house layout. This is it. Like, wow, pretty simple today. But we're gonna make it Christmassy, a Christmas modern studio apartment. Yep. How's your guys' December? How's your guys' December? It's been raining a lot. Cool. Our house is all floored up. We're doing great. <gasps> Ooh. I'm trying to figure out where the where the bed's gonna go already. I'm gonna use the modern bed, the double modern hairpin bed. Oh, maybe I should add some windows on this side too. Uh, do I want windows on this side? I'll, I'll add one window. This right here is going to be my thumbnail. Those string lights are kind of a problem though. We'll see. Also, by the way, do I want some wall trims for this? I think I might add some. I really like it. I love how simple it is. We'll just do, you know, wooden planks. The usual. The usual. What else? Decisions. The decisions. That looks really weird though. How else do I make this look better? Like, look at this. This feels weird. Does that feel weird? No, I guess not. Maybe I put a wall here instead Ooh. okay that can be a railing but this can be a wall right i guess they can do that let's get some lights some table lamps i'm gonna use these cylindrical Ooh, i don't use this very much what if the theme was also like <laughs> to add on to the the modern studio apartment christmas in my milk carton alley what if i made it like with items i barely use as well because there are those items that i forget exist or not use at all okay let's try it let's see how many things i can use oh it's clear ceiling lamps you know i haven't used these since the good old 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 days of blockberg but they don't look bad i mean they don't look bad as long as there's light which there really isn't much that's some bad lights uh, spread Ooh, okay we'll, we'll try that we'll try that oh we could put it like at the end of the bed that's a thing right people do that <laughs> people put their dressers at the end of the bed then your feet can't get grabbed by the monster under the bed you know <laughs> and then of course i want to use the new like blankets and stuff Ooh, i want to use the messy long blanket this time i don't use this too much Ooh, that looks fun okay and then i want to have a basic blanket hanging off of it okay now i'm kind of wondering if i should just put the bed over here i think that would be better <laughs> Gosh, i think that's what i set up those windows for this is so much better oh perfect okay i'm just gonna flip things around not a big deal gotta use your space wisely and that's still fine right there too perfect now i can put the dresser like over here <laughs> sort of i hate when the dresser's like on a window what if I just do that? What if I just did that? I really want a TV there. I mean, I could still put a TV there, but once again, I'd be blocking the window. I don't know if that's a good design or not. Oh, uh, yeah, you have some sunlight coming through still. It's fine. Okay, perfect. <gasps> Wait, that's so much better. Okay, see, simple things like this. Amazing. Okay, I think I'm gonna put some bookshelves to some bookcases. It's perfect. <gasps> you know, I want to hang up on the railing here, this balcony. I'm gonna put a garland on it. Yep, I'm gonna put some garlands. We can just do the plain ones for now. And then I can put some lights on them and it looks like it's decorated. Ooh, maybe some banners on it too. I don't like that. We're just gonna put lights on it. Never mind, no banners. Ooh, I think this is decent. Window two from outside. Okay, maybe change some colors. Some warm lighting. I mean, that's really all I would add up here. I mean, I could put some more like random clutter. Oh, maybe like a tree. I wanna decorate for Christmas a little bit. I kinda wanna decorate the the dresser with a garland too is that too much i think i'm being too extra here <laughs> how does that look <laughs> that looks that's too many trees i'm going a little overboard with the trees okay that's all for upstairs i guess it's really you know simple but it works it's cozy it's cozy all right let's go downstairs <laughs> i'm working on the living room and the kitchen now okay let's do the bathroom next because that's also <laughs> an easy place to work on and it's a two by two i kind of like want to make it a three by a two by three a three by two yeah let's just keep it tiny tiny bathroom it's all good oh wait i'll just do this i'll put the shower here and then the toilet and then the sink right across perfect easy get a nice plunger 
in case there's a there's a clogging happening. I was about to say flood. <laughs> in case there's a flood in here. Get a carpet too. A nice little carpet. You guys know my bathrooms. This is the pretty much, it's, it's not even just my bathroom. It's the standard bathroom, right? You just gotta have your shower, your toilet, your sink pretty much. I don't do too much with my, oh, I wanna use the inset walls actually. I think that's in windows, right? Yeah, that should be in windows. I need to add an inset wall. Yeah, there you go. Add some more add something more to the bathroom i didn't think of that before okay i want to go overboard let me let me see i'm gonna put it behind the toilet first and if i don't like that i'll just use that one <gasps> imagine okay what if i have two inset walls in my bathroom hey look that's not too bad let's move to the kitchen now because i need to figure out how this kitchen's gonna work with this diagonal piece here unless it'll work out it'll work out it'll work out okay i always bring this idea up but yeah i could probably do an island Yes, I will do that. Ooh, what if I put like a wall here? Ooh. <gasps> oh my gosh. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, this could be interesting. Oops, not like that. <laughs> that was not what I wanted. Okay, like a basic opening here. A little bit closed off, but have it like peek into the kitchen a little bit. There are some nice houses that have this like little feature, you know? What if I do that? Ooh, interesting. <laughs> interesting. If I put a TV here, it's gonna block the, the, the opening again. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Not a good design. Not a good wait. <laughs> let me just let me just flip this over. It's fine. I'll just flip it over like this. Oh gosh, now it feels even weirder. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, it's interesting. It feels different. <laughs> feels different. Okay. Now I'm gonna replace these pillows on this couch. And then a bench here as well. So you can chill, put your shoes on and such. <gasps> we put some pillows. <gasps> put some pillows on the bench as well. See, I'm doing some new stuff. Okay, we need like a small pillow in the middle because then that would be super comfortable looking, I think. Like a smaller like pillow. Wow, now see, look, the bench is just... Okay, not a good example, but it looks better than it being plain now. See? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm trying to see if there's a better one. Expectations are a lot higher now with these pillows and blankets, but I'm not going to complain because, um, you know, more customization is always great. Files in there. <laughs> They're so... the most random things I'm just going to put in there. The little things truly make the house feel lifelike, though. Like, you would never... I mean, yeah, that's the, that's the thing of life. You always put these, like, little things around your house. And that's what makes it feel like a home. You just... Some people are probably like, oh, no, I, I, that's clutter. That's too much. That's too much of a mess for me. But, yeah. I'm just gonna put, like, some random decorative vases there. Okay, great. Okay, guys, I'm I don't, so I'm sorry. I'm just gonna use the neutral colors here. Neutrals, you can never really go too wrong with neutrals. So I'm just gonna make it, like, yeah, like that. Maybe one accent wall somewhere. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna change up the texture of the bed. I guess I can just change some colors now and like clutter because I think I pretty much have everything I need just for like the basics of the house. So that's what I'm going to do. Let's do the yard and then I'm going to decorate off camera. It will be good. <laughs> okay, what do I do here? Oh, barbecue area outside because yeah, this looks very fitting for a barbecue. So we're going to we're gonna add ourselves a nice barbecue grill and we're rich again, guys. We have a 1.9 million. I say we because we are rich. It's very busy up here now. Very busy. And then I'll put like some drinks on the side here. Super busy now. Maybe I should just make like a mini garden. I'm gonna make a garden. I'm gonna cut out so many dumb things I just said. I said outdoor greenhouse. Yeah, I'm just gonna have like a little mini garden outside. So we have some like planter boxes. Person loves carrots, make them grow carrots. Okay, that and um, cactus, cacti. Yep, full on cactus. Okay, that's our yard. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and decorate the rest off camera. Add some more clutter, maybe um, polish some things. Yeah, I'll be back. Okay, I am pretty much wrapping up my decorating and such, yay. Oh wait, there's already a trash can out here. All right guys, the next house is finally complete in the milk carton alley. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look. So from the exterior, just looks like a, you know, a pretty simple building. Uh, so let's start with the outside, I guess. Let's start with the exterior, the yard. But when you go through here, you got you know, some plants, as in some plants, there's carrots and cacti. Um, but you pretty much just have, like, a general outdoor family eating area, barbecue. But as we go inside, here is, here is the house. So when you walk in, we got the kitchen here. Uh, changed some colors to just, like, the sage green and white, pretty much. Uh, yeah, it's a nice kitchen. I also changed the gingerbread house to red. Um, it's a red gingerbread house. Yep, that's perfect. And then, oh, I really like this area here, too. So over here, I put, like, the coat rack. And on top of that, I put a shelf and, like, combined it. So... It kind of just, it looks really nice. I'm actually, I'm actually, 
I wouldn't say proud of it because it was really easy to do, but I'm proud of myself for thinking of doing something as simple as that. So <laughs> there's that. And yeah, I liked how this turned out because yeah, it's just a place to sit, put your shoes on. Th these areas by the door are my favorites to like make, even though there's not too much going on, but yeah. But next door over here is the living room. So we got the milk and cookies for Santa. I actually didn't really know what to do. I could have probably put some plants here, but Christmas spirit in the house. I just put a table of milk and cookies. It's perfect. It's very, very simple stuff. Here's the bathroom. And look at that. Some inset walls inside the bathroom. Crazy, I know. Something new. If you go up the stairs, you have the bedroom. Normal bedroom things. Okay, and I did keep the garland and the lights on the dresser. It's not bad. It's very festive, though, I think. It's very, very festive. Uh, that's pretty much the house. But yeah, anyway, guys, that wraps up today's vlog work episode. If you guys enjoyed it, you found it inspiring in a way, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And make sure you hit the subscribe button, too, because it's completely free. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. I had fun decorating this. It was really fun. You know, finally, another house building in this milk carnally is complete.